Ladies and gentlemen, the amount of hype for this episode has been crazy. So many people just glazing this episode. People going crazy. It is 5.52 in the morning right now. The stream has entered the ninth hour in 14 seconds now. And my brain is dead. There is nothing going on here. There's about four hamsters running as fast as they can in their fucking cage to, you know, get the power going. I'm going to try my best. This reaction is going to be delusional. Hopefully it is that hype. 30 minute fat premiere. Let's begin today's reaction. Cult members. Al. Al is the one that flooded Pristilla. Al is the one that killed Pristilla 10. Al is Subaru. Subaru is Al. Break time shit. The parallels. Last episode. Priscilla and Al. Sorry. Amelia and Priscilla. Fuck. My brain not working. Remember. Subaru and Priscilla. Most of the episode together. Al and Amelia at the end. Remember that? Arc 3. Back alley. Priscilla and Subaru. With Dumb Dumber and Dumbest. And Al and Amelia show up. It's almost like Tapi is trying to tell us something. Right? The parallels. The mirroring. It's crazy. But how could he have known to kill the Priscilla 10? Because the incentive there is you don't want to leak t phones remains because they know the information. But this was done apparently, cut content according to, that like it was done before the first broadcast. Doesn't that imply that he would have to have future sight what's going to happen to have done that preemptively? I don't know, but here's Al, bro. He cutting people up. Them cult members are getting slaughtered. That's right. Right leg and left arm, you know, thing too. Lot and same height. Same height for, you know, Meteor. This is what he picked up. So this does prove that the Meteor is not a one-to-one -one connection. Because everyone was saying Capella's across the board and regularly just talking to Capella. But I had the notion that it could be a one-to-many where the different, you know, Meteors could be present and like you're calling something else and whatever picks up, you just get that call right there. Hey, Media. How I was told? Whoa, 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 whoa. What do you mean? Wait. Who told you? Who told you? What told you? You got a gospel, bro? You wanna tell me something? Are you pride? Who are you, bro? <sighs> yeah, coincidence for sure. Sugoku mentioned. Say no more, sister. I am Subaru. They're fucking things to us, bro. He is him, right? Take that fucking mask off. Mm. Info, info, info. Dude, isn't this the soundtrack that plays when like Fortuna and Fast Sad Emilia shit back in season two? This is sad soundtrack. One second. This soundtrack is the sad soundtrack though. I remember this. Whenever they start shit playing, you know, sad Emilia kid crying. Oh no. No koto mo aru kara. Beatrice no koto wa chanto mamotte agete ne tte. Hyper positive English? English? Hmm? She wants to be tough though. That's right, she is tough. Growth. Yep. Look at that Amelia growth. She said sorry, but corrected herself to say thank you? Oh, that's some season one shit. That's some arc two in Roswell's garden underneath like this place where Subaru says sorry, sorry, sorry. And then Amelia says, you know, a thank you is better than a lot of sorries. And the more I think about it, Gomenne arigato. Serious lines. Who told her thank you sorry shit? Fortuna? Oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. Hey. My brain is working at 6 in the morning right now. Not bad. Not bad. It's, it's kind of there. All It's kind of... It's, it's, it's lucid. It's gonna be deranged. Wait, wait. Go back. Go back. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Will he show up in a white horse? Maybe. That's him. Dude, the way that he talks to Amelia? Am I crazy? Maybe this is biased. This is like so biased because I'm like, I'm like basically working backwards, right? 
I'm like on guard that he is Subaru from a different timeline. And the way that they're talking, like something about that was very reminiscent of how they interacted. Like maybe I'm crazy. I'm deluding myself. <laughs> Prince on a white horse. Prince. <laughs> Imagine he doesn't. <laughs> he said, fuck Subaru, bro. I get a million this timeline. Subaru's having fun with Biku and Amelia. I had to walk out of the frame during break time, bro. Fuck that motherfucker. I'm done. Because the main character is about to pop off. We about to start yapping? Kyodai's back! To double the message? Amelia. Amelia says she hates you. Go away. No, Al's not that kind of guy. Al's a bro! Al is Kyodai! We're brothers! Brothers from the same mother? Nah, this is just Al. Al is Subaru. Subaru is Al. Al is from a different timeline. That's, that's, I'm still sticking with that. Mm. Prince on a white horse. Envy mentioned. Oh my god. Oh my god. Al mentioned Envy. He clearly has a connection with the Witch of Envy, guys. Garfield. <gasps> Oh shit, you're back too! <laughs> Full leg is crazy. That's some Mimi shit. Hugging, jumping as a hug is great. But you wrapping your legs around the mid air. He's like 1415. He's like 1415. Oh. Garfield cares about boss time. <laughs> You are crying. That's right. Everything seems to be taken away. Right leg of the dragon. I think we can feed people with this leg. Infinite regenerating leg. Maybe it's not edible like the witch fiends, and therefore Daphne's notion of, hey, you can just infinitely eat these rabbits or whales, right? It'll be fine, right? Witch fiend, you can't eat. It's, it's bad. But like his leg. <laughs> what if it's edible? And if so... The claim that Subaru is Jesus Christ, there's a lot of religious themes in this show. Obviously, you know, Jesus Christ died for our sins, is what the source material says. I'm not sure if there's a wiki for- <laughs> The wiki is a bible, bro! <laughs> Read the fucking bible! No, the bible's too long. The bible is the, uh, web novel. The bible is the light novel? The light novel artist doesn't exist! This is what happens when the reactions are 6 in the morning right now. I'm on the ninth hour of this fucking stream. Okay, uh, going back to it. Uh, other, other than the wiki in the Bible. Fucking uh, Subaru, leg, eating, right? Church, if you got to church, you drink like grape juice and you, you, you eat a fucking bread piece. And they're like, oh, you've consumed the flesh of Jesus our Lord and Savior. Oh, and stuff like that. Hey, I don't know, bro. I don't know where I'm going with this. Huh? <laughs> That was just like her. Just worrying. What's that? Hmm. Anastasia was like a little bit of a. <laughs> I was like, hmm. You don't treat Biko right. Biko don't deserves better. What the fuck was that? Oh, she's getting reckless, all right. She's getting reckless. Hopefully nothing bad happens to Amelia. <laughs> Her little statue. <laughs> more, more Amelia sound effects. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> she thinks that she don't know, bro. You got caught in 4K? You gotta put the blanket over your eyes, statue? Come on now. Dude, it's actually so cute how she thinks that this is like... <laughs> oh yeah, I definitely covered myself there. Mountain girl shit. Hashtag mountain girl. <laughs> this is mountain girl shit, bro. The purity. The naive ignorance purity, bro. This is the mountain girl, Riz. <laughs>
どうしてそのまま逃げてしまわなかったのですかだから私、逃げてなんて。I'm gonna save you all. Liberate them, Amelia. もしかしてどうしかったの ?I think she's wishing the best for her, yeah. そしたら、あなたと奥さんたちも大変なのにどうして ?Amelia, free them. 何の意味もなかった。先生を出したつもりが何の意味も。Was that when she was smiling as Regulus railgunned her? And she was like, all right, this is my piece. I'm done. And then Amelia saved her. Is that what they're talking about? What are we going to do with this? Wait, what are all these people here for? What are we using that giant media for? Well, this is a radio broadcast shit, right? We about to start yapping to the town, right? <clears throat> My check, my check. Skibbity, skibbity. Wait, 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 wait. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who is the skibbityest of them all? Is what Super is just say to all of Pristella. <laughs> to fucking just. What? Who said that shit? We're going to do a speech? We're going to tell everybody? Yeah. I thought that Liliana were serious would use it, not Subaru. Yeah. Oh. oh, that's a lot of casualties. Okay. Oh. Okay. Okay. They're safe. No, I don't think stepdad is good. The stepdad, I think, is the dragon, right? The eye color and his actions when helping us get out, and the fact that stepdad didn't fight against Krush, but the kids are safe, okay. The fuck was that? What's Anastasia doing with their hands? Look, look at Anastasia's body movement. The fuck was that? If she was from Gusteko, I'd say that this is some this shit. If it was Gusteko, but she ain't from Gusteko, the holy theocracy. She's from Karanagi. What was that? What is that, bro? I don't know. Like, I got no clue. I got no clue. I still think that she knew ahead of time that like this would happen, though. I feel like she definitely knew that the archbishops were gonna attack. How though? Is there anything that can give a future sight? Something similar to the gospel. They mentioned about the dragon tablet, right? Dragon blood, dragon tablet, and the covenant are the three like, great treasures or something from the dragon. But the copped up tablet is Lugunica stuff. And the tablet's supposed to kind of like prophesy stuff, right? That like, okay, you got to like find the royal selection girls. That's what was in like episode one, sorry, 12, season one, right? I don't know. How does she know if she does know? Yep. I'm gonna calm them down, rally them, inspire them, maybe? Yeah. My check, my check. <laughs> I have a dream! <laughs> What's Super gonna do? Do some crazy speech to get everyone out? If only people could see him. Because I really wanted him to just do that fucking pose when everyone's like, oh, 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 Lisa Nargaib, Lisa Nargaib. But like, uh, let's see how good he can like motivate team morale here. <laughs> the one piece is real. Yeah. Rallying cry. What? Cut it off? Attack us? They just flood us through speech? Al. 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 Think about the incentives that helped Julius and everyone else. That flood helped everybody. If we do process of elimination and think about who was missing at that moment, right? It's not Sirius. Sirius was busy doing shit to, you know, Anastasia and them. Capella was also busy, confirmed. Regulus is busy. Roy was fighting Yuli. Lai? Who knows? Gluttony could be. But the incentives of it helping us. There's someone else going around. 
killing Priscilla 10 before, the incentives, it aligns with what our cause is. The one person that's been mysterious and doing their own step shit has been Al. He never even went to Priscilla. It's gotta be Al. It was Otto. It was Otto all this time. <laughs> Why not? <laughs> Why not? Otto. <laughs> but like, if we assume Otto is Pandora, why would Pandora intentionally do this shit to get in the way of her own minions, right? The incentives don't match up. Why would Pandora do something that would help us? Unless this is all part of the big plan. Ah, nah, nah, nah. Uh, is there anyone else we can answer? Oh, here's a fucking wild card guess. Yoshua. I've had ain't no other fucking reactor right even knows who Yoshua is, bro. You know why I know? Because that motherfucker had a letter. That dude had a letter, and letters are so, so, so important in ReZero in the way that they never meet their targets. The empty letter in Season 1 with Rem. The letter meant for Amelia when we were in the sanctuary. Now, Yoshua with the letter informing gluttony stuff, but we haven't heard back from Yoshua. What's he up to, bro? Nah, to think that he did it, who knows? I don't know. Russell's too busy fucking doing weird shit back home with Ram. I'm gonna just uh, guess it's Al. Mm -hmm. Yoshio's probably dead. I don't know. And no one's even talking about Yoshio. He could straight up be eaten. They're baiting us to do it? Huh? What was that? How do you know this, bro? You know so much about them, bro. Al, what's going on? They've never lost. They never even had to think about losing. Betrugu's lost, but like I guess they in this context right now, I thought it was, you know, about all of which cult. But like, okay, they're getting cocky. They're not even thinking about it. Hmm. What dragon would care what the ants at its feet are planning? Yeah, that's some Lannister shit. Does the lion give a fuck about the opinion of sheep? <laughs> I don't know. This, the dragon mentioned though. Dragon mentioned. Hmm. Speech time, speech time. Who should do it? Obviously, it's gonna be Subaru. It should be Garfield. <laughs> no, Garfield would ruin the speech. <laughs> we need someone who's well spoken. Well, who's some funny people? Felt would be hilarious. Felt would be like, Y'all are trash. Come on, get up, motherfuckers. Fight for your lives. Priscilla. <laughs> Priscilla shows up. Oh, hello, peasants. <laughs> hello, monkeys. Enjoying your time in Pristella? <laughs> just listen to me. Felix? Felix will just go, nyeh. <laughs> Better the goose. I mean, Better the goose should show up. What? Huh? Naka, 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 naka. Do you imagine Better the goose had the fucking mic and he went off on a fucking rant, bro? Yeah. Nah. You. You are the legend right now. Like, again, I don't think people are aware of, like, the feat. Like, the timeline of ReZero. Because, like, a lot of people watch ReZero, you know, after four years, four years, and then they just watch Season 3. I watched all of it in the marathon. I did so much cut content. And it is crazy to understand the buildup before Jesus Christ literally arrives to, you know, Lagunica. It's also funny because the calendar year, they name the calendar times. Like, before Christ. Before you know, Subaru shows up. It's crazy. Oh, what's going on? Milky me with the thick ass raid. Milky. Thank you so much for the raid. Appreciate that. We're streaming later than tonight. Usually I would have raided you if you're still up, but looking like I'm going later tonight. Milky. Hope you had a great stream. Where are you at? Milky Mew. Guys, please check out Milky Mew. She's a very cute VTuber. She yaps. She reacts. She yaps, just like us. Ladies and gentlemen, showing up from the Milky Mew raid. We're currently watching ReZero, season three. Ugh. Episode seven. Hope you enjoyed the burp. Have a good night, Milky. Or afternoon, I don't know what the time zone is. But uh, I appreciate it so much, guys. Go give her a follow. And uh, let's continue. Let's continue with this shit. <laughs>
そりゃここはアナスタシアさんの出番だろう応戦候補者でアナスタシアさんの口から戦う言葉に期待するんは We need a hero, bro. We need a messiah to talk. 知名度の話だけでいく,いくんならうちも喜んで Yeah, but うちの名前に魔女教の不安 I wonder if they'd be like, oh brother It's that fucking billionaire corpo shill on the fucking mic. Yep, 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 yep. I don't care, billionaire. <laughs> Would they be mad that Anastasia is talking? Because all she is is just rich. Like, think about it like this, like in Dragon Ball. When, we're, when you need the spirit bomb. Goku and Vegeta couldn't do it by themselves. You know who fucking showed up and compelled the masses? The fucking hero. Mr. Hercule. Mr. Satan. He was able to compel the masses to do it. Right now, these people can't do it. They can't do it. But there's one person in this room again who is an actual fucking legend. Right? White whale subjugation. Right? Better goose subjugation. One of the craziest things that's ever happened in Lugunica. They were never able to do this with Theresia von Austria. Better goose is also super active. And he did this shit within a matter of days. Literally like a week after embarrassing himself at the royal capital. He literally commits the impossible. Does it. Miracles are being performed. It's literally Jesus Christ. And again, the whole like religious like Christianity themes revolving Subaru. It is insane. I think Tapi is being very, very intentional with the Easter eggs. And like in the references. And no doubt that a hero like him that's recognized. Even Wilhelm said like, bro. The entire fucking like continent are talking about you. You have no clue exactly how crazy your reputation is right now. Thank you so much, Jada Foxo, for the hundred bits. That's right. We need Subaru. Really? みたいで尺なんやけど。Are we good enough? I don't know what's happening with Crucia's face right now. She's also probably unconscious. Mm. She was. She would be great for this, but not right now. It's not the same Crush. It's not the same Crush. Yeah, totally different character too now, due to the memory. It's you, bro. I'm only good for L'Oreal. Advertisement. Commercials. Glam. He's just a pretty boy. Yeah. I'm not gonna call him sissy ass liberal fucking knight. Spirit arts. Ooh. Whack. Trash. <laughs> I don't respect that. We need a dude that can fucking ape out. We need a dude that can speak from the heart. We need Donald Trump. <laughs> dude, there's gotta be a meme, right? There has to be memes. Of Donald Trump giving the speech in Subaru, right? I'm already giving you the idea. I bet that no one has done this on YouTube yet. If you can actually make good content edited and have Donald Trump overlaid as Subaru doing this speech and say some crazy shit, like... <laughs> I can't do a Donald Trump impression at fucking 6 in the morning right now, but like... Yeah, bro! <laughs> Deport all of them! <laughs> It's you. It's you, bro. It's you, bro. He never even thought about it. That's right. He actually has defeated Better Use. Bro, we did that shit. We did that shit the night after staying all night defeating the White Whale. Who is more qualified to inspire hope, to fucking perform miracles? It's Jesus Christ himself right now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and Reinhardt's fucking always AFK. Reinhardt might be the biggest fraud of E-Zero. <laughs> oh, I'm feeling feisty tonight.
My brain is barely awake right now. It's trying to stay awake. My Reinhardt's a fucking fraud, bro. That motherfucker. <laughs> that motherfucker always AFK. Tape always removing him from everywhere. He ain't doing shit, bro. He ain't doing nothing. He's benched always. I have no faith in Reinhardt, even if he's here. <laughs> Yeah. Mm -hmm. It's you, bro. Oh, new soundtrack? You have the resume, man. That's right. When he was white knighting, harder than actual white knights, the fucking royal court. That's one of the funniest gig lines in that read zero in five minutes. Brother. You're a white knight and harder than actual fucking white knights. If he could just do something like this again and just pop up, but this time with actual merits, this time with actual accomplishments to inspire hope in others, this is gonna be unreal. <laughs> Top three. What's the other two? Uh, number two is gonna be when people found out that Subaru was too busy writing. Um, you can do it, Amelia. Woo, Amelia! Wow, wow, wow! I mean, Garfield saw that and Subaru was a cringing so hard back in season two. And number one, again, this is just all my kid can head cannon. Number one is the day that he showed up to school cross dressing and did the whole, you know, Anatsuki Subaru this. Actually, I think it's uh, it's a lie that he showed up to high school cross dressing. But someone said that I don't know. But like his like high school debut, thirteen. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You got a debt you could never pay me back, bitch. That was crazy. I was, yeah, yeah. Not responding to his mom? That mom deserves that shit. <laughs> mom doesn't deserve it. She's a little dumb. I love the mom. I'm sorry. Yeah. You need, we need more of that shit. Yes. Literally the night after everything happens so fucking fast, the wait, right? And the other thing is Lukunika has no fucking rulers. Lukunika is in a time of peril. Fucking Jesus Christ descends. He just solves all their fucking problems. And what are they thinking? Like, holy shit, he's actually doing it. Not one, but two great witch fiends subjugated. Great rabbits chilling in a different dimension. But you know what I'm saying, right? Liberated the sanctuary. The resume is crazy. And if he is able to unite everyone here and get the credit on behalf of every other royal candidate here and say Pristella, one of the top five cities in Lugunica, against the archbishops, right? And if he even defeats them, a legend has been born. Liliana will be writing songs that will transcend generations. Subaru will have a fucking statue that does fucking this in the middle of Lugunica, bro. Like, bro. I, I don't think people really understand, like, the gravity of the situation. Of, like, how much things have been hyped up. The amount of accomplishments. Everything boiling to this one point. And we do this shit. We say, Pristella. Lista na gaib. Alice looking sus. Let's go. <laughs> no look at Al. No look at Al. Oh? <laughs> Let him cook. Let him cook. Let him cook. <laughs> Yeah, that guy's a fucking fraud, bro. You know how I know? Because I'm him. Fuck that guy, bro. Getting a million beak on this timeline. I got Priscilla. She a bitch. <laughs> that might be your boss too, though. And I wonder if he's speaking from experience. This is a level of introspection that one could only have if you kind of live that life. How the fuck would you know this? That's a level of like, level of like empathy and putting yourself in another person's perspective. Like, like what? Sus. 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 I feel sorry for you. Are you projecting right now? Because you failed where Subaru succeeds? Like, 
Al, I feel like, is the Subaru that had a really dark timeline. Something bad happened. And everything he just mentioned there is probably from experience. And he let other people down because he could not fucking do it. So therefore, he's kind of like pushing this onto Subaru, in my opinion. This is a bit Roswell-esque. Focus on one thing only. The starting line of your resolve. Remember Roswell shit? Remember? He said, sacrifice everything else. You only care about one single thing. Save that. This is interesting. The dark Subaru. <laughs> Al is Roswell confirmed? Oh shit, you're right, bro. He's wearing that helmet so he doesn't have to put the makeup on. Yep, new theory, guys. Al is Roswell confirmed. Oh my god, guys. <laughs> Mm, nah. No. This almost feels like a warning, man. It genuinely does. But a true hero can save everything. Ideals becoming reality is what a hero is. And Subaru, I'm sorry, Al. You're not him, even though you probably are him. Subaru can do this where you fail. Also, the best part right now, I can start yelling again. Because it's 6.30 in the morning, and the nighttime silent times is from 11 p.m. to like 6 a.m. So some roundabout way, we can start screeching like monkeys. Let's fucking go! Okay. What do you say, Kyodai? Okay. He's just a good guy. Instincts. Wait a minute. What did you say? Wait a minute. One more time. Yeah, if a little kid jumped out into the street at a red light, and again, this is like more reality Earth shit, because, you know, Al is from Earth. But take this example and lay it over on episode one, season one of ReZero. Subaru gets ported. Wow, this is an isekai world, so cool. Wow, there's beast girls and elves, cool. Oh, a little girl jumped into the street with the carrots coming in. Surely I have a special power. This dude didn't fucking jump in to save that girl. He's like, now's the time. Firebolt. <laughs> Shit. You fucking liar. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Heroic delusions. Sure. If I can't do it. But like, heroic delusions? Isn't that better than just regular delusions? I'm down with heroic delusions. Let's go. Yeah. Yeah. That's what we've been doing since season one. Yes, sir. <laughs> you guys are saying his eyes. Did we see his eyes there? I saw just pitch black. Let's go back. Let's go. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Turn off the lighting? Fuck you, you're trolling me! No, you, 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 you're you genuinely all trolling me right now. Alright. I see it! I see him! I see his eyes! But like... The eyes don't really tell me much. It's just eyes. Like, like, it, 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 it's, it's just eyes, bro. I see, I see it. I see the white. I, <laughs> what is this gonna tell me, bro? It, it's, this shit ain't gonna tell me anything. I saw it. I saw it, but like, so what? Like, yeah, I, Al is super, super is Al. It's sharp. It's, it's not enough for me to tell that it's actually Subaru's eyes, but I think that it's definitely going in that direction right now. I definitely think it is going in that direction right now. 
ここで決断したら負けちゃいけねえのいつだってそうだろう重みが違え It'll be everyone's losses But I got returned by death, baby! I can keep doing it over! Straight bet, baby! Episode 7! Moments before disaster! Nemure. Along with my daughter. Bro, these moments are crazy good! Chills, brother! Memory lane! And could you at this point see Subaru in Amelia's eyes? You couldn't, right? The funniest shit is season one finale ending with Amelia present in Subaru's eyes, but Subaru was never present in Amelia's eyes. Cause she don't love him right now. It doesn't really do that shit. Um, this part, I still think I always go back to the scene and always say the same talking points here. I think there is such big symbolism here because this is Flugel's tree and Subaru is apparently a sage candidate. And Flugel is known as a great sage one time from the subs. I don't know if he is the sage, but I've heard of it. And, oh yeah, the number 2002, right? Um, I was talking about the tree shit. The 2000 is also sus because, you know, 2000, you know, that's the number of satellite shadows. You know, Puck was mentioning half of shadow. You got to use at least half of the shadows. But because Subaru is a great sage, like a sage candidate, and the tree has been chopped down here to defeat the white whale, is this, you know, a clever way of saying, like, Subaru is this generation sage you know what i mean and another crazy shit what if flugel is such a big brain person he literally predicted this flugel was like i think in a couple hundred years there's gonna be a moment when this tree will fall down and kill the whale so i'll plant it yep i'm gonna plant this shit because <laughs> in a couple that's how smart he is he just no he's not that guy as written, as written, brothers. Satella, which of envy, Echidna, Petra's handkerchief. Beautiful. Armenia. Yep. Exactly what Al said all those times. We've been doing it since season one, baby. Everyone else's losses, we've been repeating that we burr, we literally burden everything on our back. Motherfucker is Atlas, more fucking Jesus Christ shit. Him dying of other people's sins, maybe that's a bit of a stretch, but straight up, this is Jesus Christ, the Messiah. Mm -hmm. You'll become the symbol of hope, bro. <laughs> Do some all my shit. Don't worry. Why? Because I am here, bro. Become the symbol of hope. So what the fuck? Legend has it that the dragon, the hero, which was a sword saint, Right? Dragon was Volcanica. Here was Reed. Van Astrea. The Sage? I'm thinking it's Flugel, but it could be someone else. That sealed the Witch of Envy. Bro is a hero. Bro is a Sage candidate. And Bro has a dragon leg. Is he everything in one? Am I so delusional right now that I'm reaching like crazy? Listen, my hamsters are running at max capacity right now, clocking to overdrive. But like, I think I'm onto something. Let's go. What if he stutters? <laughs> Y'all ever do public speaking that you forget what to fucking say? <laughs> and everyone just like. Hello? <laughs> no, you, you can't stutter! You can't stutter! <laughs> Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? Voice crack. <clears throat> Hello, everyone. Oh, Pristella! <clears throat> Pristella. <laughs> well, no. Everyone start laughing. 
You know what? No, 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 no. no genuinely, in public speaking, and you saw this in Rochtere, you saw this in Rochtere during the public speaking debates. What does the main character do? He does a self-deprecating joke. And then it cheers everyone up. They start laughing. Soul washing would then turn them into happy. Happy, happy, rather than sad, sad, mad. I don't think Al's very happy about this shit. They probably worrying about me? Al was very negative. No, I think he did, did it in order to like prevent Subaru from, uh, what's the word? Turning out like him. It feels like a uh, very like a person who's gone down the dark path trying to prevent someone from doing the same shit again, but Subaru is different, right? So uh, I don't I don't know. Bye, Al. Oh shit, the speech is happening. Yes. <sighs> Yeah, we, we did take 20 fucking minutes to decide who's going to talk. That's pretty funny to me. <laughs> and the craziest thing is, this is 51 minutes into the reaction right now. <laughs> we still have the fucking speech, bro! Oh, loud! Believe in Amelia. Whoa, did you see that? He's like, I don't know what to do. What to do? She just turned around and composed herself there. Did you see that? Damn. Like, oh no. Because. Purity. I don't know. It's it's like oh the, the the mere fact that they know her is like a violation of Regulus's rights, and his wife must be cleansed of everything that's corrupted. <laughs> Holy <laughs> shit! Well, lucky for you, <laughs> Emily got nobody. Who is around? If we're gonna say Minerva is Emilia's mom, she ain't around. Who the fuck is dad? Maybe Puck he ain't around. Who the fuck is, you know, if, 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 with the fucking Fortuna? Serious, maybe? I don't know. <laughs> job's done. That's right. Job's done. Oh, shit. Here we go. Oh, man. What's a mic? Because this is more modern Earth shit. Okay, here we go, bro. Mic test, mic test. I still think that one of the most clever strategies to do, one of the most important things when doing public speaking is commanding the audience. The first impression matters. If you show up and you're fucking weak, the entrance is weak, nobody cares. So the best thing you can do is tap the fucking mic a couple of times. Make it go, and everyone's like, ah! And they're like, what the fuck? And you got their attention. You crack a joke, easy the mood, and fucking smooth them, baby. <laughs> Man, they really just believe everything, huh? <laughs> if I was just someone random listening to this, I'm definitely not witch cult, by the way. I'd be like, the fuck, I ain't sus. <laughs> Their hopes are already up. Aww. Aww. <laughs> Let him cook. Because <laughs> it's funny because the hope was already there and still. Simply by saying, just like, yeah, I'm not part of Witchcraft. They're like, are we saved? Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, by the way, they're not done yet. And uh, we don't really have control of the towers. And uh, we, we could get flooded too pretty soon. And um, oh, oh. <laughs> no, break them down, then build them up. Just like the exact opposite of Fate Zero. Caster's mentality of how to experience true terror. You give him hope. Oh yeah, you can get out. You give him hope. And then you fucking take it away when they're happy. It's the exact opposite here. You gotta give him no hope. It's Doomer. And then you'll say, BUT! And then build him up. Well, 
今みんなはこの本所にいる人たちやひょっとすると避難所に逃げ込めないラチンズプシラだってのにリリアナわざわざ変ベルテンワッハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハハ This is dumb, right? Because dumber is Ratchet, and dumbest is the fucking mushroom head kid whose divine protection is being really good in bed. Yo! Guess d o n Yeah, this guy! He's alive, though! He got bottled in the head. I don't know. Is this Heinkel? Yeah, this is Heinkel! This is Heinkel shit! The bottle in the head! Why the fuck is he here? What is he doing, bro? What are you, what's he doing? Ricardo! Oh, by the way, I also lost my leg too. Oh, man. The,、uh, the vibes are bad. <laughs> the, the mood is. But hey, remember, let him cook. He's building this shit. Okay. Actually, rather than a cocky hero say everything is going to be fine, you know what would really instill hope in people? Someone that is also going through the same shit as them. Someone so relatable. The common man. That they can be like, damn, I feel like I could be the one talking right now. But then the common person that they can relate to gives them hope. You know what I mean? So, like, this, all of it, this, this shitty little, you know, destroying their hope right now? I think we're cooking. We're onto something here. Okay. I'm waiting for a bug. Ricardo! It does. <laughs> you know? Oh man, this my lawyer were cooked. Me. <laughs> These people are just. <laughs> this is our hero? <laughs> Everyone is just so fucking dooming right now, bro. <laughs> like, oh shit. <laughs> But wait, let him cook. Let him cook. But. Oh, Loose Bell is thinking. Wait a minute. Nature. Doesn't this guy sound like the dude that saved us? Wait, wait. Also, this is not Loose Bell, this is Fred. Listen, it's almost 7 in the morning now, okay? I'm reaching the 10 hour mark of my stream. Out of the five hamsters in my head, two of them have died off. Two of them are running. And the third one right now is, is really struggling, okay? The, the, the CPU, <laughs> we've gone overclocked for too long, okay? I'm, I'm cooked. I'm cooked. Okay. But. New song play? Here we go. In my apartment! At seven in the morning! Because I'm an unemployed neat that does nothing but watch anime all day! Oh man. Here we go, he's building it up. Okay. I feel like even Al got serious here. Al, so far, I felt like it was like. He's not paying attention. He's like, whatever, this is a fucking. List. Now it's like the butt part. He's like, he went from. Oh, wait. Yo, wait, he's cooking right now. Hold up, hold up. Al's locked in. That's right. Being isolated makes you ruminate. Doom post. Aww. Oh, I can't believe I'm making this joke right now. I'm so fucked up. What about Krush? When you say look at the face, I'm thinking about Felix and Krush right now. Oh no. I'm a demon. That's right. Fight, brothers! Fight my comrades! Oh, he's getting serious now! 
There we go, he's yelling! Alright. That's right. Yo, every royal candidate right now. Even Priscilla smiling. Priscilla is smiling, bro. Everybody, Amelia, Priscilla, Felt, Anastasia, they all, like Priscilla especially. I mean, she, I'm sure she loves this shit. Remember, always match her, you know, like vibrato. Always match her arrogance. She'll find them entertaining. Felt. Anastasia. Bro, <laughs> Subaru's speech was so good. It fucking awakened the slumbering princess. What the hell? Dude, <laughs> imagine if Rem woke up like this, but it's impossible. She can't, she can't just yet. Fight, brothers, sisters. What if he riled these people up so much and didn't hear this part? I just said, Yeah! Tatakai! Wow! And then they all go outside and they all just get slaughtered by the fucking witch fiends. <laughs> like the Debbie fiends, bro. <laughs> because Subaru riled them up. I think that would have been a fucked up run that I would have loved to see. Like, that would be so cruel for Tapi to do that. For Subaru to have this moment. Inspire hope, but they got too hopeful and inspired and motivated. They all ran out and they all got slaughtered. Holy shit, could you imagine? Look up, that's right. Don't let your crown slip. That's right. There we go. This is some crew stuff, right? Yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Crew, like all these different things. This is when I think we were uh, drinking. I, was it the drinking part? I think a lot of this, you know, things right now, you know, keep your head up high and stuff like that. Right? I think so. Give me hope. There we go. I do. I do. <laughs> まだやれるって。俺だけなのか。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違う。違
私を助けようとしてくれたあなたにも手になってもらいたい結婚幸せになるための儀式 That's right This is gonna be the biggest divorce of all time bro We somehow if we're able to defeat Regulus and save all these girls bro The amount of divorce Every woman <laughs> So many fucking divorces happening at once And then where do they go? Right? Do we have a plan for them? Where the fuck they gonna go? I know a certain somebody, a certain hentai Piero, who has a lot of mansions and could hire them all as maids, bro. Yep, fucking come, come work as maids, bro. Juice. Fortuna. Okay. I have friends. That's right. Puck? What's that motherfucker coming out? You know, if Puck was able to show up, also, I don't really know the implication of here. That was close. I almost made a big mistake. What does that mean there? Because she said, I'm not alone, actually. And then maybe revealing that information is kind of what she didn't want to leak. I'm not too sure about this line, but her grasping the crystal here, as she says, let's do the wedding. Could you imagine Puck finally shows up when it's just like, does anyone have objections? I still want Subaru to fucking show up when, you know, we're doing the corny line. Does anyone have objections? Right? And then boom, either Puck or Subaru show up. Do something crazy, bro. Let's go. Wedding crashers. Imagine he dies here. <laughs> imagine he dies here and he has to repeat the speech again. But like, he keeps dying. And like, imagine like the seventh iteration of the speech. It wouldn't seem genuine anymore. He was like, I'm so fucking tired of this shit. <laughs> the speech would change. The more he kept dying, the more the speech become more and more hostile and like doomer. <laughs> nah, you did great. Yeah. Ricardo loved that shit. Yeah, we do have, you know, the girls. We do have the lollies. We do also have Patrash. Ricardo actually picked up on that. That's crazy, bro. Because Ricardo a beast man, bro. He can't just stand up down that Patrash really is for Super bro. <laughs> <laughs> I would love to see Patrash's reaction during the, you know, the speech. Al, what do you think, brother? Al has nothing to say. Al looks away, bro. Why, Al? Because you know that, like, you're trying... I, I still think that Al's trying to save Subaru from walking down a path that Al failed on. And Subaru kind of crossing that bridge now, I guess, is what makes him concerned is looking down like that. But I think he means well. And I think he does mean well. Also, I never noticed the two scars here he had on his arm. Another meme edit of this you could do is have Subaru speech, but like no one's listening. I'm giving you so much memes right now that could easily break like 100k views out of fucking nowhere due to the trends. Subaru's speech, but no one was listening. Subaru's speech or something else, bro. And he's just yapping, yapping. And everyone's like, what the fuck is going on, bro? Jesus Christ. Just fucking <laughs> schizo. Schizo. Because like in his perspective, he's just yapping. To us, we saw everyone else be like, Tatakoi, Jigo. In the media, the speech, but the media wasn't on. <laughs> Cringe. Ew, who the fuck was that, bro? <laughs> There's so many meme potentials of this, bro. I like the Donald Trump edit, too. <laughs> Pandora! What the Pandora? Where did you show up from? Sus. Sus. Reinhardo! Ryuken! Kensei Reinhardo! Can you do something finally, bro? Yeah, we got the hero. We got two heroes in the building. Woo! Yeah, Astoria. Yeah. Oh! Okay, and motherfucker, if you get bent, if you don't deliver after doing this shit and Tappy figures out a way to bench him and nerf him, I ain't gonna.
fucking loser, bro. Today's episode's called The Newest of Heroes and the Most Ancient of Heroes. The newest of heroes most likely refers to Subaru. And the most ancient... I don't think... I don't think, like, um, Reinhardt's so old that he can be an ancient hero. But right now, we got two heroes in the building, man. I love the fucking hockey. Boom! Look at that aura. And most ancient is out. I mean, maybe. You never know. It could also be the Sword Saint family, right? Yeah. It could be the long line of Sword Saint families. The ancient lines. And then, you know, and then it could also be the newest one is, like, Subaru, right? I think um, this is a crazy episode. Because, like, a lot of people who don't watch ReZero for, like, the lore, the dialogue, the conversations, the implications of what these actions do in the future. And the people that only care about the actions, they're going to think this is cringe. They're going to think that it's episode one all over again of season three. But what people fail to understand, again, is the time of Lugunica that we're entering in. The royal family all dies off mysteriously. They need to figure out how the fuck are they going to figure out a new ruler. Because there's a continent down below and above that may start fucking having beef with us. Valakia and Lugunica apparently had beef a long time ago. Is it not the most opportune time to literally pull up and, you know, take control of a destabilized nation? And during those times, who shows up? Natsuki Subaru. Jesus Christ descends and then solves fucking miracles. Subjugates the White Will and Better Goose in the same fucking day if you count the White Will as like an overnight feat. After a week of making a fool of himself at the Royal Selection. Then he continues to do the impossible and frees the Sanctuary. You know, defeats the White Rabbit. And now, the Great Rabbit. And now, if he, after inspiring every person here, uniting everybody, and we can defeat four Archbishops attacking Pristella, the impacts of this, the implications of the future, it is on another level. Amelia Camp is going to be worshipped. Nobody can fucking, you know, like... Basically, Priscilla looks better than us right now, right? I don't know what the fuck happened in the year gap, but Amelia, despite those feats, they still is unfavorable because of who she is. But this is some irrefutable shit. Where we accomplish this and give credit to the Amelia Camp, Natsuki Subaru gets a fucking statue doing this shit, Amelia Camp will be just glazed. And truly, this is... The second coming of Christ. This is the Messiah fucking saving us. And he's performing miracles in front of us, but a lot of people probably don't really give him too much about, you know, just the yapping parts, but like, damn, bro. Damn, bro. This is so good. And that's it for me. If you're still here, though, and if you enjoyed this reaction, please like the video. Check out the other playlist for even more content. And until next time, take care.